Clark County, Indiana, lies on the banks of the Ohio River, sandwiched between Louisville, Kentucky, and Scott County, Indiana, a rural community that received national attention in 2015 because of a deadly heroin epidemic spreading across the state and nation. Clark County residents and leaders quickly learned that they had a problem of their own. Heroin in particular, the reason it is so dangerous is is you get violently addicted to it the first time, not just psychologically, but physically addicted to it also. In January 2016, Clark County CARES, which stands for Community Addiction Resources, Education, and Support, brought together a panel of concerned citizens and community leaders to begin a conversation and break down the stigma of heroin addiction. This is an epidemic. It is having devastating consequences in our community and communities around here. These drugs are very dangerous because they're street drugs. Uh, there's no consistency and potency, quality of the product. Uh, so there is a disturbing trend in overdose deaths, uh, suggesting the problem is getting worse. You're looking at the hepatitis C and the HIV infectious diseases are growing here in Clark County. Uh, at an alarming rate. And we have to come to uh, terms and understand that this problem is uh, moving at a rate and effect that the snowball that is getting bigger. I see the same cases over and over and over every single day. We get a minimum of five new felony drug cases filed every single day in Clark County. The panel had a consensus. Stop addiction where it starts. 75% of the people who use heroin started with a doctor's prescription. Uh, so these are not junkies who decided uh, for the first time to just stick a needle in their arm. The panel agreed that the only way to solve the problem was to come together as a community. So the way we get in front of the problem is with us as a community. Um, we have to recognize when people have addictions that they're not to be ostracized or left alone or judged. They need to be helped but also key in that is, is noticing it in the first place. Uh, with us together as a community and reaching out to those that have that uh, problem with addiction and getting them on their way to uh, recovery, I think that is the key element and important. I see it from the, the aspect of policing. I see it from the aspect of housing people in the Clark County Jail. And I, and I, I just love the fact that we're all coming together as a community because this, it's a community effort to fix this problem because you look at the wide range of people that are here tonight, from the judge to myself, to the chief, to the attorney general, to uh, members of the church, the community leaders that are here, we realize how big of a problem this is. And the only way we're going to solve it is solving it together and talking about it and explore all options. By coming together as a community and communicating about the problem, Clark County, Indiana residents and leaders are stopping the stigma and ending the silence of heroin addiction. I had someone come to me and say that um, she had an adult son who has some very serious issues, has had for many years, and she had tears running down her face. For her to know that there was someone who could hear her story, receive her story, and hold it with her rather than to judge was um, an amazing thing. And that saves lives. We have to try to save as many lives as we can. You can't affect a cure. You can't have a recovery if they die of an overdose. I'm Linda Margison for Ordinary Hoosiers.